There's a story about this fireplace. Yes, I need to say only in that corner used to be his TV because the TV was very special to Mr. Mandela and the radio because he had FM radio like this and he carried with him all over because suddenly he had access to the world. But leave it as that. The fireplace, when Mr. Mandela came here, obviously he had some health problems and that was one of the reasons why they moved him out here. Yeah. And um, that chair used to be here. And the first three weeks they provided wood for Mr. Mandela and the thing was burning and then suddenly the, the commander said, sorry, no wood. And then Mr. Mandela said, fine, leave it like it is. The next Monday, the doctor came to visit him. He said, he, he made a complaint, he said, I need this, I need the heat and everything. And they gave him a prescription. He need to have wood every day. And the commander could not believe his eyes. And he had to just basically give the wood at, um, give the wood at a time. So, yeah. So, this was a special encounter for Mr. Mandela. I suppose the thing right. we forget is he, he was a lawyer after all. He was a lawyer. He was a lawyer. He knew his rights. 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 He knew and that corner was a microwave. Microwave oven. Now, let me say to you, Aiden, when Mr. Mandela came here, he was 70 years old. He celebrated his 71st birthday in this house. So, at the time, he was already 25 and a half years in prison. Now, you can imagine what happened in a period of 25 years. I mean, 25 years ago, there were no cell phones. We can hardly imagine it. Now, one of the things that was in this house that Mr. Mandela had no idea was a microwave oven. He stood there. He came, walked through the house, the TV stood there, the microwave, he said, Made the remark, hey, this house has two TVs. <laughs> One of the guards immediately realized this man don't have a clue about micro ovens. They came, put in a bowl of water and boiled it. And then Mr. Manelikin said, now I don't want to touch. What now? They said, now feel, it's cold. And then he feel, and then they said, now put your finger inside. He put his finger, and he burnt himself. And he actually laughed because whenever the ANC colleagues came thereafter, the first thing that Mr. Mandela would do is the same trick. <laughs> and microwave. So it was his first encounter ever with a microwave oven in this house.